just got done doing a extraction of bees out of a tree in Middletown, New York, over at a couple's property. Uh, what we did is we went ahead and put the bees and vacuumed them into this box. And you can see them here. Those are all the bees inside the box. We took out their combs and we put the combs in here and we stuck them in via here. We stuck them in with rubber bands as you can see. Let's pull that out. So that's how we stuck the combs in that were there. There's hardly any honey or anything here. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take these bees, I'm gonna put this jig on top. This is a Marcel invention because Marcel is the gentleman I've been working with. We're going to set this jig right here on top and what that's going to do, it's going to allow us to put the bees in appropriately. And all we really have to do now is, we have a swarm cell in here in case we didn't get the queen that was in here in this hive. Now we're just going to take this box, we're going to set it right on top of here. It's all in there and secure. We have this little piece here on the bottom. You just simply pull that back gently. And immediately the girls will go down inside and they will, you can actually see, look, watch them march inside. It smells so delicious. I have to say, these were the kindest, gentlest bees I've ever worked with. In spite of all the, look at the little, two little kissing bees right there, aren't they cute? I love the girls. Anyway, these girls are so incredibly gentle. Hopefully you can see them going down inside the hive. They're all happy to see each other. Say, look, we got a new home. We have a new home. I can smell our house in here. Here's the, here's a bee in here. A couple of them are fanning away. This box was relatively full, and now they're all moving down inside. So we're going to leave that there until this afternoon, and we're going to come back and we're going to feed the bees. We're going to make up some sugar syrup and water, and then we'll feed the girls. You can tell the queen's there because you can see how she's spanning her little wings there. That's a relatively good indication that we have the queen and that she's inside this box. See how they're all clustered back there in the back corner, all those bees? Well, they're clustering there because that's probably where the queen is and you're trying to tend to her and keep her warm. So it should take a couple of hours and all the girls should be back inside. Being a beekeeper is a great adventure. Marcel is leaving for Europe Tuesday, so I'll be taking over for him while he's gone. And we'll see if we get any more calls. I had two calls today. So we'll see what happens. Well, I'm JT. I'm the bee guy here in Orange County, New York. I have an update for you later. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for looking at the bees. We love them.